can I please pull on something different? Please. What, wait, what are you working on? Just show them what you're working on first. No, but just for this minute. Yeah, but just show them what you're working on. I know, but let me just, please. It'd be so much better because if it, okay, we're going to just feel great. Let me at least just, this is the worst outfit all possible right now. Let me do something cuter because I want you to post this. Hold your shirts. I'll sit back down and we're going to still be working. So it won't, you won't lose the moment. But that outfit was terrible. Oh, I'm uh, I'm draw I'm drawing. Okay, so I made this. Um, let me get this up. I made this Raiders thing. I drew it um, on paper, but I, you know, I didn't have a regular pencil, and so um, I it, it ended up having like a bunch of lines and stuff in it, which would drive me nuts. So then I remembered that I have this amazing Apple pencil. Here, oh, where's the way? Oh, I was charging it. Here's the top here. Um, this Apple pencil here. And so now I'm touching up my Raider artwork with this pencil. It's so amazing. So you zoom in here. And then and there's white, which is not a pen that I had. So now I can color in the white. But I'm having such a good time. And I started crying because it, it's just such a nice experience. Um, I always, you know wanted to be an artist, but never thought that was something I'd get to be able to be. And now with technology, you can really do all the art you wanted to do and never got to do. Like I never took any art classes when I was young, but I've always enjoyed, I've always enjoyed writing words. I don't tend to know how to draw, but I tried my, this was my first attempt at drawing the logo. I just looked at it on the phone and then I just drew it. Um, so I think it turned out pretty good. But now I'm fixing it up with the Apple Pencil, which is so seamless in so, so a sense of like coloring. I wish I had this when I was young. You just go like, it's beautiful. Like you just color in the letters like this. It's so amazing. And what's cool is like, if you mess up with this, you have black and white, which is so cool. So you go, oh, I messed up here. Oh, let me just go like this. Or, oh, I messed up there. Oh, let me go like, let me change the color and then make it black again, which is like not what you can do when you're normally, um, oh, that's um, that's Walmart. Uh, that's Me. our beef. You wanna get it, Jared? You gotta sign for it. Hello, for oh. Joy. Okay, hold on one second. Yeah, I know, I'm gonna. So, um, that's so exciting. We just got a Walmart delivery. So here's the thing. We don't have a car ever since, you know, the cave when our, car, when our Jaguar got stolen. For all you guys that don't know, we had a Jaguar that got stolen in 2017, and we decided never to replace it because we kind of enjoy, uh, you know, walking and, and stuff. But you, but it gets expensive with Uber, so we figured out how to get delivery for most of the things we need. So you can even get delivery for beef. So Walmart just delivered the organic beef, and then we also get delivery from Whole Foods. But I like the beef from Walmart, so it just came. It's amazing. Delivery, we do Amazon, Amazon delivers Whole Foods, Walmart now delivers, it's insane. We're in an amazing world. So that just showed up. I'm working on my beer thing and then I'm gonna cook some uh, burgers for us. Some organic beef burgers. Because I found that was the most healthy uh, for me since I was bulimic for over 15 years. And I've tried everything, and I was even a vegetarian for about eight years, and vegan, vegan, and vegan for several years, and vegetarian for several years, and um, and then uh, we did Atkins, we did everything, and the only thing I found when I uh, stopped my bulimia that to stop the bloating, because I was getting this terrible bloating, was to eat all organic beef, and no gluten, no dairy, no GMOs, no caffeine. Um, no alcohol, no artificial anything, just organic beef and organic greens and garlic and stuff like that. Oh, my husband lost about 150 pounds doing that and I was able to recover from bulimia. You have to work out, yeah, you just um, be active a little bit, like use a couple of nunchucks in the house and stuff and you can be super fit. <laughs>
Shout out to my man Kelly Kwame. We on top. Shout out, shout out, check it out. Check it out. 